is the beach on the um, other side of the island that has the blue footed boogies. We just walked across through uh, the prickly pear cactus, which have evolved a giant stalk, which is uh, unique to the Galapagos. Looks like a prickly pear umbrella. And then we're here on the lava filled beach, lava rock filled beach, looking at these crabs, which are everywhere. They're dark red, they're bright red. And they're just sunning themselves. The water is the most beautiful, it looks like recycled glass, the color of recycled glass when the waves crash. crash. San Cristobal Island is the uh, place to go for surfing. People do come here to surf. They say they need some help. Most, some of them or all of them? We uh, found some it of them. Under we a bridge we, and it's we monitor of some of them. Like okay. Side, maybe a we cannot do it with all of them. Obviously not, because we have a big population of over maybe 50,000 sea lions. Appear to be very so we monitor some of them. We the Galapagos is volcanic. Volcanic, oceanic islands. That is the uh, mockingbird which is making noises yeah. there. Ah. So it's a volcanic island. Volcanic why? Because they uh, emerge from the seabed by volcanic eruptions. Punta Estrada. Oh, we're gonna take a walk about maybe what metros, Catherine? <laughs> this is the beginning of the mating season. Because when they are mating, they get nicer colors. <laughs> and this is when they are more aggressive each other between <laughs> the males. So they don't tolerate each other when they are mating. What is around the head. Uh, you, you, I don't see any other male. So these girls uh, some around? girls and some uh, youngsters. What is the biggest size of the iguanas? Now we are talking about this. This is also very interesting to talk about the marine iguanas. <laughs> Thank you. And because the, you said that the biggest size. And I have another question. <laughs> Una otra pregunta. The biggest size. It is not the biggest size. This is. The iguanas from this island mm -hmm. can get maximum this size. Okay. But in other islands, mm -hmm. they can get oh. one meter twenty centimeters. That is a type of uh, brown navy, navy N O D D Y, and the blue for the booby, and the frigate bird, and the cactus. So this is the typical environment in the Galapagos. Volcanic lava. That's the blue flag right there. Mm. We're talking about volcanic islands. Did you get it? Yeah. Can you say what it was? Luis? Yes. What is this thing? The black bird with the red? That is the frigate bird. Frigate? Yeah. Frigate. Frigate bird. This is the male. The male, the frigate bird. That little one here is a brown navi. Navi. This is navi, N-O-D-D-Y. This is a type of sea bird. Then you have the typical one, which is the, the blue footed This bird. is that uh, lava heron. Lava heron? It's the green leg. Oh, she, where did she go? She's rock hopping. Maybe she's eating the crab. Yes, she's pretty tame because we're very, very close. And she's not bothered by us. I think she's heading to the crab. You gonna eat a crab? Look at those crabs. They're like, get away from me, bird. I think she might be looking for dinner. It's a standoff. Oh, she's going in for it. You're gonna get pinched. Yeah. 
They're giant. Do you see that we have four here? Four? Four? Yeah. Four. 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 Pardon? Four. We have giant tortoises. It's possible to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but take care of it so you don't fall down. <laughs> Can we go in the, in the grass? Okay. Watch out. Just be very careful. Yeah, huh? yeah and, don't, and what about not to frighten them? Yeah, this you one's put putting his head, yeah, his head is going inside. <laughs> Look, that one's running. Oh, no, it's I like a tank on feet. <laughs> How do I do it? Just take... Uh, indietro. <laughs> Anula, maybe? No, no, Anula. Okay or indietro? Indietro. Indietro. Okay. Back. Do they okay, have now. tails? That is a good one. That was a good one. Yeah. Good. Thank, Thank you. you. Is that a boy or is Thank that a you. tail? <laughs> it, it is oh, a boy. There's another pond full of giant tortoises. And here's an old boy that's running, maybe running away. You know, sometimes if you want to get a nice picture, Is that a boy? Uh, no, no, no. They are, they, no, they are all boys. Okay, Vidal is taking a turn, <laughs> getting in. All right. Uh, now what? You know, See if you can walk. Yeah, we'll find out. Do a push up. Uh, all right. Uh, oh, Jesus. Use the pole. Yeah. <laughs> can you grab that pole? Oh yeah, I will try to. <laughs> oh, almost out. That's good. Oh, oh. <laughs> <They're a> little... <laughs> you know what? They're little things there. <laughs> oh, it feels good. It's like a what do you call? Acupuncture. Acupuncture. Oh, here's our greeter. Big daddy. It's a male. It's multicolored. Females are all black. Males are multicolored. He's watching me. I'm not getting any closer. Oh. Like there's our vehicle. Okay, Mr. Sea Lion, come out. There's one. Uh, she's a miss. How can you tell? She's very nice and sweet. <laughs> Look at her face. Males are ugly. Oh, really? Yeah. No, you know, female has much more delicate. Oh, pictures, really? Yeah. The face you can see. here cross over this little sandbar and there they are right there hanging out and barking
most peaceful and beautiful, calm place I've been to in a very long time. This is the Pacific Green Pacific Green Sea Turtle. Actually, the Pacific Green Sea Turtle and there's is the, the only white sea turtle that nests in the Galapagos. So this They're is the only one that could be area. It was kind of a construction area. It looks like a big um, dugout area where water has settled. And the flamingos used to go to town, but apparently they replaced the wheat water, which is not salinated and so the flamingos prefer the salt water because it has flamingos. crabs the um, salt water the ocean water in town with estos sitios pero prácticamente aquí parece que no habría un sitio adecuado como para nidar por ejemplo porque ahí uh, ellos construyen el nido con el lodo entonces aquí el lodo es una es una esta es una laguna muy muy nueva muy joven entonces no hay mucho lodo aquí que para construir los nidos ellos construyen como un castillo de lodo ¿No es cierto? por aquí no parece que después de este no va a ser sitio de anidación para ellos tal vez en más adelante que se desarrolle un poco de más el lodo podrían anidar aquí se de flamingos de nesta uh, uh, close to the, the lagoon or sometimes in the lagoon they build the nest with mud but you know this is a very new lagoon so there's no enough uh, mud to build like a muddy castle, which is what they do. They, they build like a muddy castle where they lay one single egg every year. But this is the ki kind of... You know how to call that. Yeah, I'm trying to imitate what he's issue. doing, but as you can tell, it's not anywhere near. That is a chicken, silly one. the <laughs> one. <laughs> Although they seem to be attracted to my end of the uh, row down here, so... Maybe they are listening to me. This is uh, the famous, these are the famous Darwin things.